Well, Dakota, it's lovely to virtually meet you. How's it going? Good, thanks. How are you? I'm doing very well. Massive congratulations on Madam Webb. And I have to say, I was talking with SJ and Dahar earlier about how it's so interesting to see a, a superhero film be more kind of brains versus brawn. So was that something that was appealing to you when you read the script? Yes, for sure. I never, I didn't think that I would be a part of a superhero movie. Um, but the fact that her superpower was her mind made me really interested in it. And even though like it is more mind focused, it is it was still actually quite a physically demanding role as well. So how did you tackle some of those intricate sequences? Um, well, I did a lot of training before we started filming just to be strong and fit and, um, you know, able to like do a lot of physical activity for days. Um, and we had incredible stunt supervisors that were helping us with everything and teaching us how to do everything. So it was really, you know, I learned a lot and and had amazing guidance. Yeah, I think one of the the core aspects of Kathy's storyline as well is her bond with her colleague, of course, played by Adam Scott. So what was it like working with him so much? He's so wonderful. He's, you know, such a funny person and so kind and so talented and, you know, just a joy to be around. Yeah, it's quite cute the way that his character keeps trying to, like, bring Cassie around to all of these, like, family events, even though she's like, well, I'm not really comfortable with, with all of yes. this, and especially like babies, which is kind of a reflection on like modern women, which we don't get to see very often. Yeah. Yeah. I liked the, how honest that was. Definitely. And, you know, you've been working in this industry for quite some time and you have worked with, you know, one of Ireland's own, uh, Jamie Jornan as well. And yes. I have to say like, the Irish accent, it was voted the sexiest uh, in the world recently. Would you agree having having worked with him? Totally. <laughs> yeah. did, he te did he teach you any Irishisms or anything like that when you worked together? No. No, not even. No, but I, but I worked with Paul Mescal and he's a really good friend of mine. And um, he, I saw him speaking Irish and that blew my mind. Did he try and teach you a few few words now? A few couple, no. couple? <laughs> no. One day. One day. We'll get you there. Uh, before I let you go, I do have to ask as well, with this role, it's a lot more, say, blue screen, green screen than we have seen you do before. And I know you said in an interview recently that at times you were like, this is, is really strange. So how did you adapt and sort of grow into it from to work in, in those circumstances? I just like let my imagination go wild and ended up having so much fun because when there's absolutely nothing around you, you at first it was a bit jarring, but I but I I ended up having a really good time. <laughs>